So, as the periodization goes for all things, I'm gonna have like a, well, this is what I do anyway, because I work a labor job. I try to keep the volume down when I'm peaking, and then on my deal of week, that's when I throw all the, like, I don't know, volume in at like 60% or something like that. So today would be like, just arm stuff, whatever the fuck you feel like choosing. Just three sets of 20, make it tough. And uh, get in and get out, make it tough. But the general idea on your on your deload day is that whatever whatever is hard on parts of you that are starting to get worn out a little more, I don't know, say prematurely, say like, for me, my fucking elbows start to get beat up from training, you know, the, the fucking tape press, the face press really, really heavy. So anyway, like today, I'll just do some cable extensions, three sets of 20, and then, you know, those days are just one's top set, but you work up and you just add 10 aside, so that's where you get your volume from on that. But yeah, generally, you just kind of let it, let it heal up, because you're going to be beating the shit out of it again for the next three weeks anyway, so, but uh, yeah, that's, uh, that's the premise. thing for this upcoming year and there's two things I'm going to do more of and one of them is get coaching one-on-one -on -one from someone for whatever I need talk to my coach in Calgary a little bit more because it's been a little while since I talked to Luke um, and I'm going to go for chiropractic adjustments because my back and hips are all out of square and it's really I always found that you I get the most out of my training when, when things are working properly and uh it seems almost like more than mm -hmm. I get more out of corrective exercise than I do out of strength training sometimes just because everything's working properly so you don't always have to get stronger to get stronger you can just get more proficient in the lift and that will increase you know how much you can move but anyways I'm going to pay attention to those few things get a little bit of a team together and uh, start start keeping those things a little bit more consistent if you will but anyway that's 5.30 and it's time for me to make some pepperoni sandwiches for work, so work hard.